The movie Apollo 13 was, believe it or not, very accurate. All of the incidents predicted, depicted in the movie were true. Tom Hanks always wanted to be uh, an astronaut. He was a, what we call a closet astronaut, a space enthusiast. And when he heard that the director, Ron Howard, was going to make a movie on Apollo 13, he asked to be part of it. And he said, I will take a big reduction in salary. I think it was down to $12 million, <laughs> something like that. And anyway, uh, he did a tremendous job uh, portraying me in the movie. This uh, story of mine of Apollo 13 has a lot of uh, interest to uh, companies. Businesses must have good leadership, not just at the top, but throughout the organization. They, and because leadership fosters teamwork, and teamwork is the glue that holds any organization together to be successful. These, plus the use of initiative to think about solutions of crisis, you must first of all digest the problem itself and then you have to figure out what you have to solve it. In Apollo, uh, the people on the ground knew what we had in the spacecraft to solve problems and the example would be how to remove the carbon dioxide which was poisonous and how to get rid of it utilizing what material we have inside the spacecraft. So any company needs to look at themselves on how they can solve their problems. You need to share the information uh -huh, to, to be successful. If you keep it to yourself, other people who are trying to work with you, you know, go to a different direction. So a sharing is very, very important in any kind of an operation you need. And that's called the teamwork. I think the same problem today as it occurred some 40 years ago, uh, if you uh, apply the same uh, approach to solving that problem, uh, you'll be successful. And again, that is good leadership, you know, a good teamwork, good initiative, perseverance, keep on going, don't give up too soon, and be well motivated. I think you'll be successful today as we were in the past. There's always you know, a silver lining after the cloud disappears. And I think you must keep up because to give up too early is, is to court certain disasters. Bonjour Jim, c'est François. Je voulais savoir ce que vous pensiez de l'explosion des technologies de l'information et quel type d'utilisateur êtes-vous? The technology today has left me far behind. Now I'll have to be honest with you at my age, I am not using Facebook and Twitter. I do have an iPad, I do get emails, and that is fine, but I still use the old telephone <laughs> to communicate. <laughs>